everybody, my name is Jay Fatty. Today we got a super quick video. I'm gonna show you how to organize your plugins and effects so they're easier to access, okay? Now when you go into a plus here to pull in a VST or a plugin, you may not see this screen. Down here it has a couple different options you can choose from. You got categories, simple, and tree. Simple only shows a few things here and there. Nothing too crazy. Tree is going to show the categories, but kind of in a different way. If we click on it, we can see that it has kind of drop out menus for each category. The one that I like to use is categories because then you can just see everything. This works for effects as well. If we go into the effects, down here it's got categories and then simple and tree. We just keep it under categories so we can easily see things. Now to categorize some of these things, you want to go click plus on here and then go to more plugins. Go down to the manage plugins tab and it'll open up the plugin manager. For whatever plugin you want to categorize, let's just click on expand. Over here it opens up the options and the settings for that plugin. You can favorite it and it will show up on the favorite section right here, which is all of these first plugins. Or you can put it in a category of your own choosing. Let's just call this favorite sins. And then hit apply changes. We go in to add that plugin, we should have a new category. Right here, favorite sins. It's got expand there. Same thing works for effects. So if we go back into the more plugins, manage plugins. Let's just find an effect here. It will do it for replica, which is a delay. But we'll just kind of do the same thing. As you can see, it's under the effect category. Let's just put it under the favorite effect category. Apply changes, and now when we go into the mixer here, there'll be a favorite effect category right here. It's going to go in alphabetical order, so depending on what you name it, you can choose where it's going to be. If we just called these like AAA plugins or AAA effects, it would show up here on the first kind of thing. So that's kind of a simple way to categorize your effects and your plugins so you can use them and find them a lot easier inside these things, especially if you have a bunch of plugins and effects and it kind of takes up your whole screen. If this video did bring you value, please leave a like, subscribe, and hit that little bell. I really appreciate that. I'm going to be dropping a beat tape on July 14th with the homies Full Pal McGinnis and DC the Beatmaker. It's called Sky Quest. It's a bunch of really chill, lo-fi instrumentals, kind of boom bap. It's jazzy too. Really dope. If you could pre-save that, we're trying to get 20 pre-saves, so that would help out immensely. I appreciate that, y'all. The link's in the description. But yeah, make sure you stay safe, stay striving, and always be getting it. Much love, everybody. Peace.